Okay, we're, this video we're going to figure out what number is 12% of 2,000. Now if you're stuck on that, um, I want to go over a basic example just so we have the, the basics down. Okay, we understand rather than just showing you the method and you memorize some stuff and then forget it in, later on in life. So let's try to understand this. So we'll just take this easy example. Instead of what number is 12% of 2,000, we'll do 50% of 30, right? And we'll just try to understand the process here, right? So what number is 50% of 30? First of all, I want you to understand 50%. So I want you to write this down. 50% equals what over 100? 50% equals what over 100? It is what? Per cent, per 100. It's 50 over 100. Write that as a decimal and simplify that as a fraction. So give me the decimal and then give me the fraction. 50%. We got to understand 50% and, and all other percent should make sense from that. 50% is 50 over 100, which is 1 over 2. If you simplify that fraction, you get 1 half, don't you? And also 50 over 100 is 0. Point what? 0. Point 0. 0.50 or just 0. 0.5. So. I want you all to understand that whenever you're working with percents, just write this down, 50%. It's 50 over 100, that's 1 over 2, that's 0 0.5. That's, if you can understand this, you should be able to understand all percents, right? This is the, but this is the most common percent that I want everyone to just know, okay? So when I say to you what number is 50% of 30, I want you to think of this. What's a half of 30? All right, write down the answer. What's a half of 30? What half of 30 is? 15, right? Or we could be getting 0 0.5 of 30. Now, of means multi of 30, 0 0.5 of 30, right? Um, and how would you get 0 0.5 of 30? Well, watch this. If you multiply, it'll give it to you. See, of means multiply in math, funny enough. That little word OF, OF means multiply, OF means multiply, OF means multiply. So one half of 30, by the way, could have been written one half times 30 over 1, times 30, right? Which is 30 over 2, which is 15. So one half of 30 is actually a half times 30. Uh, okay, so anyway, if I multiply, you go 5 times 0 is 0, 5 times 3 is 15. And the answer is not 150. We have a decimal point in the multiplication, so we need a decimal point in the answer, 15.0 or 15, right? So back to the question that we were stuck on. 12% of 2,000, we're going to use our technique here. We turn the percent into a decimal, and of means multiply, right? And that's how we get 15. That worked, didn't it? So let's do it for all. So turn this in, 12% by the way, is well over 100. 12% 12 is 12 over 100, and what's that as a decimal? 0 0.12, right? So we can turn that into a decimal, 0 0.12. Of means what? What does of mean in math? Of means multiply. Multiply by what? 2,000, right? So we'll write it down. 2,000 times 0 0.12 and multiply. 2 times 0, 0. 2 times 0, 0. 2 times 0, 0. 2 times 2 is 4. Put down a 0 and multiply by 1. 1 times 0 is 0. 1 times 0 is 0. 1 times 0 is 0. 1 times 2 is 2. Now add. Okay? 0, 0, 0, 4, 2. But the answer is not 24,000. Like 12% of 2,000 couldn't possibly be 24,000, right? That just makes, I hope that makes no sense at all to you, because it shouldn't. Right, it has one, two decimal points in the question, so there should be one, two decimal points, places, two decimal places in the answer. 240.00, or just 240 is the answer, right? So 240 is 12% of 2,000, 40 
is 12% of 2000. And I'm just going to check that real quick because watch this. 240 over 2000 equals cross cancel. Divide by 10, the zeros cross off. Now I've got 24 over 200. Uh, 2 into that goes 100 times, 2 into that goes 12 times, that's 12 over 100, and what's that as a percentage? 12 over 100 is what percent? Well, it's 12%, 12 per 100, right? So we checked it. When we put, put the 240 over 2000, we found it is in fact 12%. Yep.